We are staying at the Santa Fe, yeah. which is one of Disney's on-site hotels here at Disneyland Paris. Um, it's one of the cheaper options, um, and we stayed here before and really enjoyed it. Yeah. Um, we also really like the Cheyenne as well, um, which is where we stayed last time. Um, but yeah, this time the Santa Fe was coming up cheapest, so this is uh, why we chose this one today. Yeah. Um, we basically the whole resort is cars themed so yeah. if you like cars <laughs> if you've got a little lightning mcqueen fan you are definitely going to want to stay here yeah. um it's really impressive when you pull up isn't it yeah it really is and um, they have the big kind of like backdrop sign and uh, we arrived in the dark and it was all lit, lit up with the neon signs and everything so it did look really really nice um benefits of staying in one of the disney hotels is that you get extra magic time in the morning so for an hour um you get to um ride some of the rides meet some of the characters for anyone else so that is one of the best perks um, and we've got annual passes um, but my annual pass is the lowest option and it's got a lot of dates where you can't come they're on the, that block out dates um, and it is currently block out dates at the moment but because we're staying at this hotel um, at any of the Disney hotels it overrides it so it means I can still use my ticket and not buy another one it means I can still go in for extra magic time so it is a real plus for us yeah. and we've not even got on the bus there is a shuttle bus to get to the park yeah. which takes five minutes um, but it's a really nice walk along the river um, and you go past all the other hotels and everything yeah. so we like to do that um, it's apparently 15 minutes but I think yeah. you can do it a little bit quicker than that um, yeah. You go through security at the um, at the hotel's end of Disney Village and then you just walk through Disney Village and you go straight yeah, to the park gates. Um, so it is really handy. We really love staying on site. Mm -hmm. um, the room's pretty basic, yeah. but you're not really in it for very long and we really do like the theming at this hotel. Yeah. So we'll show you around the room and uh, see what you guys think as well. So I'm starting at the door, um, straight away when you come in, um, there's an area to hang, if not, it's kind of like your wardrobe area. It's got a little ledge and then space underneath as well where you can put all your shoes, which is really good. And also a ledge on the top where you can store some things as well. And there's also a safe, which is not a bad size really. Um, and it's got um, a code entry, so you choose your code and then you can get in it that way. Um, so that's a really good perk. We're gonna go into the main bedroom room now um, over on this side got a lovely big mirror and um, the kettle you do have to ask for we asked for it when we checked in and they brought it to our room before we even got here but when we did it at Cheyenne they just gave it to us at reception um, and we just brought it along with us so um, if it's available you can get a kettle um, but they're not they don't come automatically in the room there is an adjoining door for um, larger parties and then if we look this way we've got two double beds you see the cars theme there, it's all kind of on the bedding and the fantastic, these lights are so cool at the back. And then you've got the border with all the cars characters on there. And then if you can see this, cause the lights, there's so many lights in this room, um, but there's uh, Mater fast asleep there on the artwork. Um, there is a ceiling fan. So if you come in the warmer months, um, that might be handy. And also in the corner there, which has been more handy for us is the heater. It's not been super, super, super cold, um, but you do need the heater on. We've got that lovely chair there. So that's the main part of the room. There is a TV, we've not really used it that much. We've been so busy just out in the parks. 
another lamp and mirror and then three big drawers on this side and also there's a really small one um, if you look <laughs> at the bedside table um, plug sockets there is one near the bed um, so it might be an idea to bring an adapter if you need more to be at the bedside if you're setting alarms and things like that um, but there is a plug socket under on that side as well yep. there's one over there and then there's one obviously the kettle's plugged in and also one underneath as well so there's five plug sockets um, but we do bring an adapter as well yep. um, so because some of the rooms we stayed in haven't had that many so we were pleasantly surprised yeah. weren't we we didn't even need all our adapters did we no so if we go in through to the bathroom um, just made ourselves some coffees. You don't get um, coffee cups, we brought those with us. Look at this fantastic mirror that's all lit up, it's really bright in here. Um, you do get some of the small um, kind of plastic cups and that's the hair dryer, which we haven't actually used, have we? We did bring our own hair dryer. It's not the best, but it's if you don't want to bring one and you just need to do a little dry, I'm sure it's fine. Um, you get um, soap and tissues and then you get um, body wash and also they give you a little tiny uh, shampoo and little tiny conditioner as well um, which are not there at the moment because we've used those so um, the shower is really powerful and it's we've had lots of hot water we've had baths and showers when we've come in over night time and there's been four of us um, but the one thing to note is the towels are quite small. So if you do want a big towel. Yeah, bring your own towel. Yeah. Um, but they're fine. They're fine for what you need it for. We've been here for four nights, haven't we? Yeah. Um, and we were going to bring our own towels, but we just didn't have the weight limit in the suitcase. So we've been using that and it's been fine. But it probably is better to bring like a full size bath towel if that's what you usually use at home. So that's it, that's the room at the um, Santa Fe. Uh, we will go, we're going to, go, we are checking out now, so we're gonna go and take our luggage to the luggage storage, um, and we'll see if we can film a little bit up at the main uh, reception area, um, so you can just see what's around up there. But we're all gonna have to be really quick because we do want to make it into the parks um, for our final, final day. Yeah. So um, if this has helped you um, and if you've enjoyed this tour, uh, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, please do subscribe. Um, we've got lots of um, vlogs from Disneyland Paris, but also uh, Walt Disney World and Disneyland California as well. And we're always off on adventures, aren't we? Because we absolutely love Disney. If you've not seen us before, um, please do check out um, our channel. There's lots there for you to explore. Thanks for watching. Have a magical day.